see you hungry, baby. What time is it? <laughs> Six o'clock now. Okay, you behave, okay? <laughs> okay now, Roxy, behave, huh? You're a girl. I, I want to thank you for trying. I want to thank you for trying because I know you're good and you mean good. You want to make me, you want to make me well and I appreciate that. Look at that, she put her head on your lap. Yeah, I oh, love you. Yeah. She's, you know, she's mischievous and she's active and, but she's also so loving. No, she's the, she's Oh loving. my gosh, she's got such a amount of love in her. I think you've done the right thing. Because I today, to this day, I said, you know, I don't even have the sound of my mother's voice or my father's voice or my brother's voice, my whole family. Like with my husband, I mean, I didn't Wait. expect that. He yeah. died next to me and I didn't know it. Yeah. If somebody asked me how much, what age my mother was, you I can't know? tell you. She never told anybody her, uh, her age, she even tried the it. doctor. Really? She refused to tell that, her age. That's so weird. And I saw I never found her age. I but I, you I'm don't know sure. The year? I'm sure it's in the death certificate. Yeah. You don't have it? Yeah, I have the death certificate. No. I said I, I don't know half the story of our family. I know my grandmother uh, was in Italy and uh, and you know there were other children. And they died. One died. He was a, a, a young doctor. And he died in the ocean. He drowned. The ocean was kind of rough that day, and he drowned. And um, and one of them brought my mother to this country because mm -hmm. my mother was very young, and he was in charge of her. But uh, but you know, I have very little. In, in in the way of, I met more of my grandparents, families and relatives because I used to go to Greenville, Pennsylvania to visit them. Where they live there? They lived where I was born in oh. Greenville because I was. So you you're born here in the U.S., not in in no. Puerto Rico. No, I was born in the U.S. In How Green about your brother? And my brother also. Here. My brother was. How come you know? How come you grew up? You went back because yeah because uh, you, the uh, jobs were impossible to get. It was during the war over there. Yeah, in Puerto Rico. No, here. And, and yeah, oh. and uh, and and they were you know they we, they had the two of us and uh, and they couldn't get jobs. My father we used to get jobs here and there, but not a steady job, and and it was difficult to keep. The kids in, in, you know, winter clothes and good food yeah. and, you know, and uh, one day my mother, they were, they must have been talking and my mother said, you know what, she says, pack your things because we're moving and she, and he said, what are we doing? She says, we're going back to Puerto Rico mm. and my my father had never been there. Okay. And she says, uh, we're going back there. Her cousin built her a home. Uh. In the project that he was making, and uh, and he he built he was a, 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 a what do you call them? Not an architect, but he built homes. Carpenter. And, well, and uh, carpenter, he designed and built, and you know somebody else did the work most of the time. Okay. He he you know watched over it, but um, he he decided he'd build a house for my mother and not charge her. Okay. And he built. Is it a, big? It, it had, uh, I think it had four bedrooms. Yeah, big. Yeah, and it, it was all tile. You could take it's a cement. hose yeah. and pull the furniture out of the way and just with the hose clean the whole house. Is it is it concrete? Yeah, concrete and tile inside, so that it's all washable with yeah. water and whatnot. Easy to clean. And um, so uh, I told them we're going there. And he says, what's the sense? She says, there you'll, you'll be able to find a job. And even if it doesn't pay you as much as you feel you need, mm -hmm. she says, we can grow food in our backyard. Yeah, the children don't need winter clothes. Yeah. They can walk around in their underwear. Yeah. You know, they're little. They don't need shoes to run around in the backyard. Yeah. 
and uh, and she says and and we can do with a lot less yeah and um so they moved my father fell madly in love with Puerto Rico and never went back to Pennsylvania oh never he went back to visit his family that's it and and visit all his family he went once a year and then he went back to Puerto Rico and took to the day he died, when he, my he mother, died over there. he died in Puerto Rico. Yeah. My mother and he were divorced, and we were gone. My brother was gone, and I was gone. Yeah. He stayed in Puerto Rico. And he remarried. I didn't like the woman he he married. She yeah, you told me that. She was slightly uh, drunk, <laughs> and she tried to, you know, she actually did. She stole part of what Dad had Give, left yeah. as our inheritance. She took it? You guys don't fight for it? Uh, yeah, no. I, I figured, well, I wasn't living there and I couldn't be. Well, it's not money, it's it's a property. It, it was it was the house that he had. Oh. And she went and she claimed it yeah. under my name mm. after he died. You guess doesn't do anything? <laughs> my brother wasn't with me and it was just me and I said, you know something? Not worth the fight. And uh, my mother's house we sold because nobody's going to be there to take care of it. Yeah. So. so, how come you guys are back in here in the US? Hmm? How come you guys are back here my in the mother? US? You're back here in the US. You, you went to Puerto Rico and then you came back here? Yeah. I went to Puerto Rico. I visited my father when he was sick. I went to Puerto Rico when he died. And then I came back. Oh, how, how old are you? You came back Oh, here. I wasn't walking yet. My brother was barely walking. My brother is six years older than I am. Okay, and then when we, you came back here in the U.S., how old are you? Well, that was when the, we moved from there oh. to Puerto Rico. I, did, I, wasn't, I was an infant. I was, so I was little and my brother was six years older. So what decided you to come back here? My mother. Your mother wants to come back here? Oh, the no, US. to come back to the, the US. US. My, my airline job. Uh -huh. But where did you apply? In Puerto Rico or here? I, I, well, my, my father was, uh, let's see, where was my mother at that time? I think it was in Puerto Rico. Because my mother was reluctant to my getting that job. My father gave me his blessings. But your mother not? My mother was afraid. Your my mother is very strict. Yeah, oh, my mother was extremely strict. Hey, listen, when I went to my graduation... Roxy, Roxy. Stop. Stop. Behave, no. Huh? When I went to my graduation, we had a, a, you know, a dance, a, a party, and um, everybody went out and got gowns and whatnot, you know, yeah. to go to this thing. And everybody had a date and everything. Well... My mother said I couldn't go mm. unless she knew the date that I was going with and she mm. approved her. <laughs> and as far as the gown, she says, I can't buy you a gown. It was a dear, very dear friend of the family who loved me. He wanted me to marry his, his son, but his son had other ideas. <laughs> but we were good friends to the end. And um, and so uh, he he was talking to me about the wedding, the uh, party, and I said, well, I don't know if I'm going. And he said, why? And I said, well, you know, mom, you know, it just is making it difficult for me. And so he says, come here, will you two and you and I are going out. He took me out. He took me out. He bought me high heel shoes mm. that I had never owned, and yeah. I was thrilled. He bought me my my gown for my my graduation. He, he bought me the gown for my graduation, and my mother worked for him for a while. He was head of uh, of something uh, with this with the. Uh, he used to go horse riding with me yeah. at their farm. He used to come on, we're going out to the farm and we go horse riding here and have fun. And um, so he he told my mother, he says, no, he says, that's my gift to her. And he says, and you can't take it away from her. 
He says, she deserves it. Mm. And my mother wouldn't go up against him. Mm. <laughs> so I, I won that, that one. <laughs> but, but so that, if, you, if you're going back to Puerto Rico now, you think you have somebody to stay in over there? I have relatives, but I think the older ones, it's, the ch it's more the children that are grown up now so that I probably wouldn't remember them or recognize them. And then you don't know where they are. Yeah, I don't know their addresses or anything where they are, but the other ones, whenever I went down, down to Puerto Rico, yeah. I either had three houses that were opened up to me I could choose, and, I, yeah. and that once I settled, then it was party after party after party by everybody being given for me. Yeah. I was in Puerto Rico. <laughs> we had a lot of time a lot of time and a lot of fun. And yet when we came back from our first trip to Puerto Rico yeah. and everybody said, Ah oh, well did you meet all of Isabel's relatives in Puerto Rico and everything they didn't know what to expect yeah. about my relatives, whether they were black, green, <laughs> what, what color they were, you know. <laughs> and um, and he said yes. <laughs> he says, but not all of them. And they said, what do you mean not all of them? I'm sitting there listening to him. Yeah. And he says, because they were all up in the trees. They're all monkeys. <laughs> <laughs> I wanted to hit him with a broom. <laughs> but they knew him well enough by then to know that he was kidding. But um, he fell in love with him, and they were crazy about our ending. They loved him. My cousin Luisita every year came to visit me and she stayed with me for a few days and we went out together. And how far How far is that, Puerto Rico? Puerto Rico, is, it's about a four Flight. hour, five hour trip. For flight? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Four hours, it's just like five hours, it's like here to Florida. Yeah, it's it's close. It's, not, it's another island there. Yeah? yeah, it's another island, it's not that far. It's beautiful. It's and, and you don't you don't have cold weather. Yeah. I think it's I think it's the same in the Philippines. Yeah, it's tropical. Probably, yeah. probably very similar. Yeah, and we have the same fruits. Yeah, and my same mother's weather. house. My mother's house was like from here to right past the tree, across straight across instead of going in a circle. It went straight across, yeah. and that was the ocean there. Yeah, it was. One, one street away, and we used to go out swimming there and went out. And they, 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 Is it a, it's a sea or a river? It's a sea. It's a sea. Mm -hmm. and, and there was a park on the other side that was beautiful. So we were, we were well set in that place. But I had to sell it, I couldn't keep it. I wanted to keep it, but none of my kids said that they could go, you know, if we... You know, no one ever went there, right? Your kids. If they, they said we're if we're working and making enough money, we can go, you know, once in a while. But I figured they could take it and go for vacation there. You know, yeah. they couldn't, and I couldn't do it. I had, I had my own problems with Andy at that time, so I, uh, I said, well, I talked to my brother. And he says, I can't do it. He says, as a doctor, I can't be leaving and just taking care of it, you know. It was sad because it was a beautiful house. It was in a, an ideal section. And um, Is it close to the city? Yeah. It was. Hello. Hello. Roxy! 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 I think they went up. Not to not the next door. There, no, there is a... There is a... Mom. Hmm? I didn't see any dress. Yeah. 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 Yeah.